Buspirone is indicated only for generalized anxiety disorder. This is a very specific condition in which one has an excessive amount of anxiety or worries for at least six months, and it comes with various other symptoms, uh, including irritability, feeling restless or on edge, trouble sleeping or problems concentrating, muscle tension such as headaches or neck pain, um, and it's also uh, an excessive amount of anxiety that it impacts their life um, either in their work or their home life, and they may get other anxiety symptoms as well. I, when I see Buspro and help people, it seems to be more of a placebo effect than the actual medication itself, and I'll tell you why, because it typically takes two to four weeks on this medication at the right dose, taken consistently, to have a therapeutic effect. However, I see patients use it as needed, uh, and they say it helps for their anxiety. I usually don't prescribe it that way. Uh, most of the time I end up prescribing this medication is because patients that have come to me from other doctors are already on this medication and they do not want to change anything. And so I continue it uh, as they were been taking it. Uh, usually it's taken twice a day or even three times a day. Uh, what is good about this medication though is it does not cause sexual dysfunction. You know, unlike many of the other anti or other medications for anxiety that I mentioned in other videos, such as Zoloft, Lexapro, Prozac, uh, Cymbalta, these are all associated with uh, problems or side effects that can affect one's sex life. Um, Busbrone does not have those side effects. Also, Busbrone is thought to be a little bit more effective for certain anxiety symptoms, such as hostility, irritability, or anger. Uh, it can take up to two to four weeks again, to notice an effect from Buspirone. And so it does not work right away, such as other medications like a Xanax, Clonopin, or Ativan. How does it work? We're really not sure, but it's thought to bind to the body's levels of serotonin and dopamine receptors and sort of interact with those receptors in the body. Uh, most common side effects of this include headache, nausea, dizziness, even trouble sleeping. But you've got to be aware because a lot of those side effects I just mentioned, the headache, nausea, dizziness, trouble sleeping, those are also uh, side effects or problems with anxiety in itself can come across like that. Other side effects of busbrone is uh, restlessness or movement problems. This is probably because of the dopamine effect. Uh, you can see this more in my other videos about antipsychotic antipsychotic medications such as Seroquel or Lanzapine, those also have a dopaminergic effect that can lead to these movement problems. Uh, and they also have many other similar side effects associated with working on the serotonin levels, including serotonin syndrome, and I've attached a photo of that here. If this video was helpful for you or you liked it or think it's good, please subscribe to the channel. It'll help encourage more videos to come out and for more people to watch the videos.